Hi everyone, and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll walk you through a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to create a configuration file using the HTTP Custom VPN app. This tool can help improve your internet privacy and connection stability on Android. If you're new here, please consider subscribing, and don't forget to like this video, it really helps support the channel. Let's get started. Step 1. Open the HTTP Custom app on your Android device. Tap the three-dot menu in the top right corner. Select Clear or Reset Configuration. To begin with a clean setup. Step 2. Open your browser and go to SSHUDP. Online. At the top, click on the menu. Tab, and then choose 7-day UDP Custom Premium Server. Then choose SSH UDP Custom Server. Note, this site allows you to create temporary, test-friendly SSH UDP Custom Server for configuration purposes. Please use it responsibly. Step 3. Scroll through the available options and choose your preferred location, for example, us. Enter your username and password. Complete the CAPTCHA by checking, I'm not a robot. Then click on Create Account. Step 4. Once your account is created, make note of the following details, server IP address, username, password. Step 5. Go back to the HTTP custom app. In the payload slash SNI section, input the server information in this format, make sure to replace the values with the actual information provided on the website. Step 6. Scroll down and turn on UDP Custom. Also, enable the DNS option for better performance. Tap on Plugin Settings UDP T Settings. Here, you can either leave the default buffer values or adjust them depending on your network. Buffer, 4. Transfer, 30. Receive, 30. Tap Apply to save the settings. Tap the Connect button to begin the session. If everything is set up correctly, you'll see a message like HTTP Custom is ready. You can also tap Unlock to view connection details. And that's it for today's tutorial. This setup helps improve your connection's privacy and performance ideal for everyday browsing or general network use. Disclaimer, this video is for educational purposes only. Always follow your local laws and internet policies when using tools like this. If you found this helpful, Please like, subscribe, and share this video with others who may benefit from it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.